Now in the second of these recordings, these little practice sessions for you, just to get you used to the idea of hypnosis, we're going to do a slightly different type of hypnosis process, something which will give you, again, a very relaxing experience, but one which is more likely to help you sort of exercise your imagination a little and draw maybe even on some past experiences. The idea of this hypnosis is to, again, just take you to a place which is very, very relaxing and in a way fortify you so that you're able to deal with any tensions or stresses that maybe have been wearing you down, worrying you a little bit. Now again, ultimatehypnosisdownloads.com, we have loads of therapies, lots that have been used with clients who come through our offices with various uh, requests to do things, and you could very, very well find these very helpful. So check out the website, site, ultimatehypnosisdownloads.com, and hopefully you'll find something which is useful for you. I'll probably post another one of these uh, little self-hypnosis exercise videos for you sometime in the next few days. I hope you enjoy them. And if you do, make, make a point of making a comment so we can, we can get some feedback from you. Thanks ever so much. I want you to take a nice deep breath now just to settle yourself. And as you let that breath out now, just let yourself sink deeper and deeper into this state of calm. Relaxing the muscles in your shoulders, your neck. You already feel nice and calm, you already feel nice and relaxed. And what we're going to do this time is to take you further into hypnosis by drawing on some of your memories. And you're going to feel really good by the end of this session. So for a moment now, just picture yourself settled very, very comfortably in a very calm position. And perhaps a little younger than you are today, perhaps going back to a very happy period in your childhood or in your teens where you didn't have a care in the world. And remember how strong your body felt. And picture yourself drifting into a wonderful deep sleep. And the way we're going to get into that deep sleep now, I want you to think about a pendulum. Now this is a pendulum not hanging from a rope or a string. This is a pendulum in a big old grandfather clock. You remember how they used to look with a heavy wooden cabinet and the big face with the Roman numerals round it and the hands moving round the face of the clock. And hanging below there would be a heavy pendulum swinging to and fro. And what I want you to do for a moment is picture that pendulum. Now, of course, they used to be a little shiny. There'd be reflections on it, distorted reflections, as it swung to and fro, tick, tock. And you can almost see it moving now, tick, tock. Only this pendulum, in your mind's eye, is slowing. Tick. Talk. It seems to be slowing down, even as you look at it. And as it slows, you feel more and more sleepy. Tick. It seems to carry you deeper and deeper into this feeling of complete sleep. Now what I want you to do, I want you to take your mind back now that you're this relaxed. Of course when you're this relaxed your mind moves differently. I want you to take your mind all the way back to a time when you were very happy. I'm going to count to three and I want you to fix that time in your mind's eye. One, two, three, now. And as you draw that moment into your, time's eye, into your mind's eye now, into your memory, your experience, I want you to focus on yourself, that moment of happiness. 
Now, happiness is a strange thing, you know. Sometimes we feel it in unusual ways. We feel it in a part of our body. We perhaps feel it right in our head or in our throat. It feels almost like we're singing for joy. Or we feel it in our hands. It makes us almost shake with happiness. Or we feel it in our chest, our heart beating. Beating with a sense of absolute euphoria. Sometimes we feel it in our tummy, a feeling of butterflies, of anticipation. Some people even feel these feelings in their legs. They just want to dance. They just want to feel dance for joy. And I want you to picture that moment of happiness that you drew into your mind and place those feelings in your body where they feel most suitable. Perhaps at that moment, maybe it was your graduation or maybe it was a, a wonderful moment of happiness. You felt it in your heart or in your chest. Maybe you just felt a general lightness in your body. But I want you to picture that feeling and draw it right into your mind, placing it in your body. And as you do so, you can almost see the colors of that feeling. You can almost feel the rush that it brought you. And as you begin to think about it now, you can feel that feeling growing. You can feel it stoking up. You can feel it making your heart beat just that little bit faster. It makes you almost want to smile. It's just a great sensation. As you think about it more now, you can feel it beginning to carry you forward. It's like being carried in a river. It's suddenly gathering speed. It's exciting now. But this is a safe river. This is a river where it's a lot of fun. You can feel yourself being washed away with excitement as it carries you down. And with every inch you go, with every foot you go, you feel even more excited. You feel that quickness of your breath. You feel your heart beating just a little faster. And most of all, you remember the euphoria of that moment. And I want you to lock that in your mind. Now, long after this hypnosis is over, you're going to be able to retrieve that feeling. You're going to be able to bring it back to your memory. And should you have any moments of doubt or worry or moments that you feel that suddenly things are getting too much, I want you to just close your eyes, take a deep breath and go back to that memory that's now so fresh in your mind. And you'll find that, yes, your confidence suddenly comes back, you have a sense of strength, you have a sense of power, and you recapture that euphoria. You know when you think of success, you achieve it so much more easily. So I want you to try and be ex try this exercise from time to time, bringing those great feelings right back into your mind. Those memories are a treasure trove, a wealth of beneficial experiences that you can bring back to your memory and bring back to your experience as you draw those memories right back into your mind in hypnosis. Now you feel nice and relaxed, you feel nice and calm as you bring yourself back to a settled, more relaxed state. It's nice to be able to get those memories. And if you practice this exercise from time to time, you're going to find that it becomes very, very easy for you to tap back into those great moments, those nuggets of your life that really are what life's really all about. Now in a moment I'm going to give you a count, you're going to come back to full wakefulness feeling great. Not worried about a thing. Having enjoyed this experience, maybe you want to forward it to someone else. Maybe you want to tell them to come and check out this little web page. Either way, you feel good. You're looking forward to the rest of the day. If you're going to be doing anything else, you're going to retain this little feeling of euphoria. Whenever you need to, it's going to bring a smile to your face. One, beginning to wake up now. Two, taking a nice deep breath and having a little stretch. And three, wide awake.